What's up guys? Today I'm bringing you another Black Ops 3 Dare Eyes and Drek Zombies video. Today we are um, going to be showing you how to get the uh, Riot Shield in the new map. Uh, I know it's kind of tricky. It's, um, you know, every map, you know, it's in different places obviously. So I'm going to be showing you guys where it's at today and how to find it and where all the different possible spawn locations are for the three different parts. So we are going to hop right into it. Um, the first piece we're going to be talking about is the jet piece. That piece typically spawns anywhere in this courtyard area. It can first spawn right here on these boxes right next to this little jar of nails. And um, that's not really, you know, the main spot, but it's just a, pot, a spot it can spawn. Second spot is right over here sitting on top of these little boxes next to these steps. And this third spot, which is the spot that I have typically found that it spawns at the most, is right up the steps, right past the landing pad, right here in this corner. As you guys can see, it spawned for me right there next to the steps. Every time I've played so far, that's where it's spawned. Uh, I know it can spawn in those other locations, but I think that's the main spawning area for that. The next piece we're going to be talking about is the actual shield piece. It can spawn in the bell tower right here next to this dead guy on the table. Right there, it's spawned there for, um, for me as you guys can see. So I'm going to go pick it up. Don't suppose anyone else feels and um, it can also spawn down here in this courtyard. It can spawn right here near these boxes next to the steps. And um, it can also spawn over here by these boxes next to this window. And um, those are three spawn locations for the actual shield piece. And this last piece is kind of tricky. It spawns, always spawns underground in the tunnels. As you guys can see right there, it spawned up on the wall for me. Now, in order to do this, you have to activate the anti-gravity sequence, which all you have to do is stand on the four panels until they activate. And um, basically, this piece can spawn anywhere in this room on the walls. So, you know, it can spawn up on top of the walls, and you have to wait till the anti-gravity sequence kicks in, and then you have to jump up and grab it. As you guys can see here, there's um, anti-gravity going on right now, so I'm trying to jump up there and get it, and I picked it up right there. So that's pretty much it. Um, it can spawn anywhere on the walls, so you just have to walk into that room and look around and try and find it. And then when the anti-gravity sequence spawns in, you just simply jump up and grab it. And then um, now you can go to any buildable table you want, and you can build it, and now you have something to cover your back. And this thing is essential on this map because this map is it has small areas, so you really need something to cover your butt. And obviously the Rot Shield is the best thing to do that. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and if it helped you, feel free to drop a like and stay tuned for more content, and I'll see you guys later.